All right, guys, we have Jimmy Murphy. How long have you been working on that? Um, what? This celebration. Uh, I think it just came to me. I don't know. I just I was so excited. It was in the moment. When the coach calls your number, late, you came. How does that feel to kind of get some offensive snaps? Um, it feels great. I'm, whatever your coach wants me to do, I'm going to do it. You know, I, lo I love this program, whether it's handing out water to the players or whether it's scoring a touchdown. I mean, there's no, nothing like being a Miami Hurricane. When your teammates say, you know, they don't mind running gasses, they don't mind getting a 15 yard penalty, just, it's Jimmy, that's my dog, we'll do anything for Jimmy. How does that make you feel knowing that you have that much support from your, your dogs? <laughs> like I said, I mean, I wouldn't be back here if it wasn't for Coach Diaz. You know, he brought me back. I, I didn't know if I was going to ever come back and play. You know, I thought it was, I was done with the game, and um, he brought me back. So I just want to really thank him. And uh, the rest of my teammates, I, I mean, it's just amazing the bond that we are making. It's not just me. I mean, everyone feels like that for everyone. I mean, I think um, to my teammates, I can't thank them enough. I remember going out and right, right before I was just about to score that touchdown, we had Nicosi Perry in there. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm, I mean, we're all very close, but like, and you go out there and you have Nikosi look at your lineman dead in the eye and say, "We got to get this not for Murph, just for us." So it's it's it wasn't just for me; it was for the it was for the Canes community and and you know it's bigger it's bigger than me. It's I just love being a Hurricane and I love doing it with my my boys. Can you describe what was going on when all the players, all your teammates, were mobbing you? What they were saying? Just, can you describe that moment? I'm pretty sure that's close enough to when. You're, it, like that's your when your child's born. That's that's how much that, that was just an unbelievable feeling, and I'm, I'm for certain I'll have that for life. Jimmy, being able to wear the touchdown rings, uh, feel a little different. Yeah, it feels awesome. You know, I'm not as cool as you know Jay Will or Reverend Jordan, but but you know I tried. You, you know you're gonna be like all over ESPN, and you know from Connecticut, so it's, that's kind of cool too. That's, all, that's awesome, but you know, hey, listen, there's nothing better than being a hurricane. I promise you that. Like, listen, walking in those buildings every day and seeing the you and seeing the guys that more than you, that's an unbelievable feeling. Did the play go exactly how you dreamed it up to go? You know, to be, to be honest with you, I, I mean, like, I'm going to go out and celebrate, but like I, I said to my coach, I mean, listen, we got to get stuff fixed, and well, what did I do wrong in the other play? First thing I said to him when he came back in, my defense, my Danny Coulter, my, my sports assistant on um, GA. And I just want to get better. And this team wants to get better. We want to grow. This is not where we stop. We want to progress. You know, so th th that was great. And uh, I really want to move on. And, and I, I really want to, you know, look for who we got next week, Central Michigan. So that's that's who we got. Manny, what? Manny Diaz says, that, yeah, this isn't going to be your, your last one either. <laughs> You're going to well, score some more. Well, whatever he wants me to do, I'm going to do it. And I'm going to do it to the best of my ability. I mean, so I could do it. Whatever he wants me to do, I'll hand out water for him. He said he didn't know that you could do a cartwheel. Front wheel. Front wheel. He knew I could do a cartwheel. Come on, he's lying. Uh, <laughs> he's lying. Uh, well, if you did, we'll do it in practice together. <laughs> what do you remember from your first tryout day? You know, from the, your first day in this journey. You know, well, I guess what five years ago now? Four, five. Uh, it was two and a half years ago. Yeah. Um, I mean, what do you say to that? I mean, I'll tell you this. When we, we got the tryout, we had, there was like four guys there. And uh, they said, okay, we'll send you an email when, when you to see if you're on the team. And uh, okay, go. And after I'm done, I'm, I text my girlfriend. I call my dad. I said, you know, I hope I, hope I made it because uh, you know, this, is all I, this is all I've ever wanted. So I was in an Uber driver about that afternoon. And we were on the highway. And I got an email and says, congratulations, you're a Miami Hurricane. I told the Uber driver, pull over on the side of the highway. On my life, you asked my girlfriend, he let me out of the side of the highway. I lost my mind. <laughs> but it was the best day of my life. Where were you going? I was going, I was going to the beach. <laughs> Just a deep brief. I was like, oh, God, I hope I got it. Did you ever heard of going to the beach? Or? No, I didn't. <laughs> I, I actually ended up going, uh, going home and celebrating with my family. and bought a lot of Miami gear, and we celebrated. When you talk about uh, Coach Diaz brought you back, what, what, what do you what do you mean? Did you? Um. So I didn't know I didn't know if I was going to be coming back because I'm going to be uh, going to medical school. Um, you know, see if that was that 
where that's going to take me. And um, after Coach Frick left, uh, I didn't know if the new coach was going to give me a scholarship. And you know, I reached out to Coach Diaz and saying I really want to be part of this team. He goes, let me just let me give you a call back. That day, he calls me back and says, you're a Miami Hurricane again. So my OM, everything. That's it. What? I I I just I, I play for him, you know, and, and a lot of these guys play for him. So, you know, I know we're one and two right now. It doesn't matter a lot. These guys play for that guy, and we love that guy. How's that conversation go though when he tells you, yeah, you're back, bro. It's all good. You're okay again. Yeah. Well, I went to church and thank God. Awesome. Thanks, thank guys. Thank, thank you. Thank you.